the lord says that as in jeremiah chapter 11 verse 4 obey me and do everything i command you and you'll be my people and i will be your god what a privilege it is to have such a mighty god as a heavenly father this lord leads us like little children the bible says in psalm 78 verse 52 and 53 then he led out his people like sheep and guided them in the wilderness like a flock he led them in safety so that they were not afraid but the sea overwhelmed their enemies yes the lord was in the midst of the israelites he was with them as a pillar of cloud and a pillar of fire the same god is with us my dear friends the lord loved to be with the israelites all the time that's why the lord says in corinthians chapter 6 verse 16 i will live with them and walk among them and i will be their god and they will be my people let this be so in your life also are you feeling lonely dear friends but the truth is that god loves to be in the midst of you god says that he will never leave you or forsake you pray a simple prayer saying lord be with me all the time god's eyes are on the righteous and he delivers them from death and keeps them alive in famine at the right time he will do great things for you and take care of you loving father thank you lord for this blessings that you have promised help me to be blameless and righteous even in the little things of my life may your name be glorified through my life let each and every blessing promised in your word come upon me let me lack no good thing i pray this in the name of jesus amen god promises to you today that he will bless you in all your work and in everything you put your hand to do this is the promise of lord praise to god amen